Of course, we do our Seattle Star of the Week, and it's hard to go with anybody else except for the Kraken, uh, considering that playoff series win uh, to do so in such thrilling fashion. You know, I believe all of these, all of their results came in two or one goal. Uh, all of their wins came in two or one goal uh, differentials, and all of the scores in this game came in one or two goal differentials outside of the. Um, four to one win for the uh for the avalanche in game six so i mean they they fought this one all all series long they were heavily heavily doubted to to make it anywhere out of this playoff series uh they take down the stanley defending stanley cup champions uh they showed great depth they did so without their leading scorer and jared mccann they're still out andre burakovsky they've been out without him the last 32 games of the regular season uh, and Seattle keeps moving forward. They, they don't have a true, necessarily true superstar, but they've got a bunch of stars and they've got a bunch of depth, bunch of depth, bunch of depth. My apologies. I guess I have a lisp. Um, and they just continue to fight. They continue to fight. Philip Grubauer continues to be excellent in net after so many doubts. I got so many comments on games throughout the years about, you know, uh, games with the years, the year. Grubauer, this and that, and he was the best player in this series for Seattle. He was the only, not the only, he is the biggest reason that Seattle is moving on to round two.